what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back today we're heading back into the sea of black sails season one episode seven i will be doing episode eight also but it will be on early access until next friday so just to let you guys know but in any case we are definitely going to finish up the first season of black sales for myself tonight um i'm looking forward to seeing what they're going to do next man you know anna's become my baby um after you know all this time they finally showed her and she had red hair i had to go nuts you know what i'm saying i am a simp for red-headed ladies <laughs> you know what i'm saying like i'm not even sugarcoating it I just know what I am <laughs> and this is what it is okay um yeah yeah that's pretty much all I have to say for the intro yeah she is the one and yeah so let's just move on and I will see you guys for the review Right, so that was what, episode seven. Wowza, wowza! So we finally got a more, a closer look at what's really happening with um, Bar Miss Barlow and Flint, and just to to get an understanding of what they're trying to do with these two characters and i think as i said during the episode i'm going to side with flint because he's trying to make some of his own not trying to surrender to give somebody else what they want so he could have what he wants you know what i'm saying he want to build something for himself and they think they got a pretty pretty good chance of doing this you know what i'm saying you can't put so many things in motion and then just be like uh, I'm just not going to follow through with it because it's not necessarily convenient for me right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to take my woman and bounce. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I wouldn't do it, to say the least. You know, I wouldn't do it. But at the end of the day, I do understand where she's coming from, but I reside with Flint's perspective a little bit more so we got the situation in the brothel with um with Jack trying to run the brothel but he can't run the brothel properly because they're stealing from him and he doesn't really know so Max kind of put him on game and let him know you know that they're making way more than that they're all skimming because old girl came in the room and told her they're all skimming from him because he doesn't know any better so get you know so she kind of put him on game because Jack didn't necessarily, um, he didn't necessarily in, in hand with, you know, making her free or anything like that. I don't think, you know, because I was wondering why she's helping him. Because Anne is the one that really helped her out, you know, to get her free of, you know, the crew, the eight dudes or that one dude that kept you know going in there at time after time and and raping her or whatever so that was uh uh pretty weird to see her help him out and put him on game like that but in any case you know what i'm saying we have the situation where um the cook we all know who he is we know he stole the page randall kind of tried you know what i'm saying try to out him and stuff like that but he convinced randall to listen we don't know they might choose the money over you my guy and just decide to get rid of you because if they don't have a witness you know what i'm saying like if if you if this comes out we have to kill flint right but if we kill flint and we kill the cook we don't have the page to go get the orca so all these things go hand in hand you might not survive this either because if they decide that they want the money and then after the money comes then we'll then we'll kill um the cook 
and Flint or whatever, they have to kill you <laughs> right now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, um, so he made the right choice saving himself. But is it going to turn out that Randall is a pretty smart dude? Maybe. Um, I don't think he's dumb. I never thought that Randall was dumb. It's just the way how he's acts is a bit off-putting sometimes. So I never thought he was dumb. And then we also have it. It looks like Eleanor wants Flint. It seems like she really wanted him to do some stuff. You know what I'm saying? In that scene right there, I think she wanted. I think she's kind of punishing herself for certain things. I think that's what she's doing. I don't think she necessarily. Sorry, <clears throat> I don't think she necessarily wants to would have wanted to you know but i think flint did the right thing by keeping it separate you know what i'm saying um you know because he's still head over heels for mrs barlow i don't think he she he knows that she is sleeping with the with the she slept with the priest or you know gave him some you know what i'm saying i don't think he knows that um but in any case that situation played out i like what she did for it for the slaves at least they won't be slaves you know what i'm saying so that was pretty cool of them to do with regards to uh, in a show that shows decision and also you know just for them in general she did the right thing and then for for mr scott to not stay i think that hurt her a lot because she's like she feels like she's losing everyone that's close to her that she can actually trust and that's the thing like she's in a very vulnerable place even though she's trying to stay strong eleanor is really trying she's really trying and that brings me to the vain story the vain storyline now that he's killed the guy now he has a crew he has a crew now because apparently this guy basically stopped sailing and being a captain and just took his whole crew to somewhere and they're farming and they're selling wood and you know he's controlling them and i guess this was a spot where he used to have slaves or whatever and brand them and whatever the situation is and vain used to be a part of that and i was wondering what that brand represents but it seems like it represents people who come from there or i don't know how vain got got away from there did he escape i don't know but he obviously he did not like that guy you know what i'm saying he did not like him but i don't know what that's about but i guess we gonna I don't know if they're gonna expound upon that a little bit more to help us to understand what was going on there but i think i got the gist of it of what went on over there when when vane was younger and stuff like that but now he has a crew uh, uh, that he can he can take all these guys and go back on the sea but then again they would they need a ship that there's that too they need a ship um because his ship was taken from him um that's the other ship that's with flint screw that um you know the former quartermaster is um captain is the captain off right now so in any case that's all i have for my review um the situation that's that's going on between them where they're planning to kill flint after um you know after they get the orca and get the money um that's yet to be seen this final episode is about to be crazy so I'm going to go watch it right now. You guys are probably not going to see this final episode, but it will be on early access. Of course, you guys already know that. But in any case, thank you guys so much. I appreciate y'all. And I will catch you guys next time for some more Black Sales. Of course, leave a like, leave a comment. Peace.